pumpkin spice latte time. I want to try the pumpkin spice Twinkies. Personally, I'm more of a pumpkin spice butter kind of person, but we can talk about this later. Homecoming tickets are now on sale for $10 each. You must have a random drug test form filled out to attend. The parade starts at 4 on Friday and the dance starts at 6.30 on Saturday. Make sure to wear your pink tomorrow, Millers. This past Saturday, the Leo Club participated in Brian's trike race in a disc golf tournament at the Blind School. Shout out to the disc golfers for placing second overall. Great job, Millers. The NHS Conservation Club is doing a food drive. You can bring extra food to donate. Just remember to place any packaged non-perishable foods in the bin labeled non-perishable food. Show out Millers and let's help our community. The Coffee Mill will be sponsored by the Millstream this Thursday and Friday in the library. There will be iced coffee and baked goods. Show up to support your student-run newspaper. The Inclusive Youth Group has infor information on how to join. Here it is. GSA has rebranded. Please join us at our Inclusive Youth Group of Noblesville call-out meeting. The IYGN welcomes all students, regardless of identity and orientation, open to LGBTQ plus students and allies. Our purpose is a safe space, fostering learning and acceptance inside and outside of school. Please scan the QR code and fill out this form with your school email address for the location of the call-out meeting. The location of the call-out meeting will be emailed to you in future correspondence. You must fill out the form in order to get an email. Once you have gotten the email, you will make a pass to Ms. Levy, Mrs. Schaefer, or Mick Spierbach to be included in the call-out meeting. We're excited to rebrand the GSA, and we hope to see everybody there on September 13th. For more information, contact Ms. Levy, Ms. Schaefer, or Mick Spierbach. Listen up, Pumpkin Spice fans. Wendy's will be debuting its new Pumpkin Spice Frosty Day. The fast food chain says it will have hints of pumpkin and a blend of warm spices like cinnamon and nutmeg for a taste of familiar fall flavors in every bite. Hopefully I can get one before they sell out. Let's toss it over to meetings. The Riley Dance Marathon committee forms are due Friday, September 15th to room 2203. Stop by the same room if you're interested in the meeting but missed the call out. There will be a meeting in room 2249 on September 13th during AL at 2.20 to discuss homecoming and fall fundraisers. Make a pass to Ms. Muller or Mrs. Pampoo if interested. If you want to experience the wildlife of the Galapagos, there will be a parent meeting on September 20th at 6.30 p.m. in room 2249. Scan the QR code to sign up. There will be another Galapagos trip taking place. This trip will be focusing on geology, plate tectonics, and volcanoes. There will still be time to sign up for this trip. There will be an informational meeting about the trip today in 6030 in the Junior or Senior Cafe. Contact Ms. Schaefer for more information. The NHS Pioneers Club will be having their first meeting on September 19th during AL in room 2202. Request an e-hall pass from Mrs. Mr. Abel prior to the meeting in order to attend. The NHS Robotics Club is meeting on September 13th during AL in room 3015. To attend, please send an e-hall pass to Mr. Wilkins. The DECA Club will be holding a call meeting on Tuesday, September 19th in AL in room 2072. If you're interested, create an appointment pass for Mr. Milby's room. For more information, please contact Mr. Milby or Mr. Rafferty. The Mock Trial Club will begin their activities September 12th and 14th after school at the 5 p.m. in room 1207. With Mr. Greenwood, they hope to see you there. The Ireland trip is meeting on September 21st at 7 p.m. in Mrs. Dwyer's room 2021. If you're interested, contact Mrs. Dwyer or Mrs. Fodiatis, or you can use the QR code posted around the school. That's all we have for today, y'all. Let's ride on over to sports. It's time for sports. My favorite is tennis. And my favorite is golf. Then let's get into it. The girls volleyball team hosted an invitational this past weekend. They swept the competition with a perfect day going 4-0 to take the trophy. Senior Riley Resmer had a total of 25 kills while Anna Elkin and Maddie Coates each had 12 aces. The Millers have a record of 11-2 for the season and play Hamilton Heights tonight. Good luck ladies. Your Miller boys football lost against Westfield in a close 21-28 game. Jacob Baker and Aiden Brewer got the first touchdown for the Millers. Gage Goley scored for the Millers next. Logan Schaffner got the Millers' final touchdown of the night. Show out at the homecoming game against Zionsville this Friday and support your Millers. 
Boys Tennis finished first place at the Noblesville JV Invitational. Shout out to Max Hobble and Nick Schmiegel for winning first singles, Hudson Robinson and Henry Reno for winning first doubles, Andrew Dockery and Joey Schmiegel for the second doubles. They play again this Friday at Harrison High School. Good luck, Millers. This past Saturday, the girls golf team competed in the Courtney Cox Invitational, placing second. The Lady Millers had eight players finishing in the top 25. Shout out to Jordan Adam for leading the Millers with a tie for second. Their next match is today away at Chantham Hills against both Carmel and Westfield starting at 4.30. Good luck, Millers. Now let's see what's happening in the pro sports world. Over the weekend, Coco Goff won her first Grand Slam. The 19-year-old has risen to fame with the former president even showing his support for the tennis player. This is the youngest American to win the event since Serena Williams in 1999. Now let's toss it over to meetings. Boys Volleyball will be hosting an open gym tonight at 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. in the main gym. Report to the gym by 6.15 and pick up is at 8.45. The gymnastics team call-out meeting is today in the LGI from 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. For more information, contact Erica Ader at erica.freeze13 at gmail.com. I think I'm going to play at the Country Club later. What about you? Nah, I think I'm going to go home and nap. But I hope you all have a great rest of your day and remember to wear your pink tomorrow.